scientific days, it seems to be the latest craze to make some great discovery with which to make a stir. Scientists each day will try to solve some problem in the sky to stop the seas from rolling or to battle with the air. They've lately solved some problems which are absolutely great. And in this chorus, some of them I'm going to relate. Who can be a refound the pole if their reports are true? Another man has also found what radium can do. To fly around up in the air, they've also found a plan. But they can't find Kelly from the Isle of Man. Who can be a refound the pole if their reports are true? Another man has also found what radium can do. To fly around up in the air, they've also found a plan. They can't find Kelly from the Isle of Man. Just mean all these scientists, all these great detectives and great explorers, and they can't find Kelly. Why, they couldn't find how Mrs. Brown's baby caught the measles. <laughs> Fancy a little fellow in the Isle of Man baffling all these people and putting the whole world in, in mystery. It's ridiculous, you know. Just uh, finding they are trying hard while all the force from Scotland Yard are searching all the country through in hopes to bring him back. There's no mistake, he takes the cake, but Sherlock Holmes and Dick and Blake have had a dozen bloodhounds and for weeks been on his track. A big reward is offered to who finds the missing link. And certainly it's humorous when you only force to think. The coop and theory found the pole if their reports are true. Another man has also found what radium can do. To fly around up in the air, they've also found the plan. They can't find Kelly from the Isle of Man. I should think they couldn't find him. I'll bet they haven't searched all the public houses. <laughs> Soon find him then, eh? I would, I'll bet. They can't find Kelly from the Isle of Man.